Israel in 2014 is a very successful country in many ways, but these kids don't necessarily know that. They don't understand what happened here in the past, and the questions they should ask themselves about the Jewish and Israeli identity are left behind. This week is a week to bring up these questions and deal with them. We want to actually take them as individuals and make them feel like they're part of something bigger. The children go out from their home and connect it to themselves, the country, uh, the community. When you're here in the middle of the desert by yourself with this quiet and now you get to think about these things, it's uh, something that you don't usually get to do. Once I know as an individual who I am, we can all be one very, very strong group because we're connected to ourselves, because we know who we are and what we can bring to the group. The purpose of this day, um, to let the people know that the group have a power. And if I have a group, group give me things and I need to give back. And I think we take a lot of values from the Judaism, the true meaning of loving a person. We want to open their mind to a bigger things. אני קורא עם ניסים, אני מאוד מאוד שמח על זה שהגעתם לפה. המקום הזה זה נקרא מאיר פנים, אנחנו נותנים אוכל לאנשים נזקקים. אם אנחנו לא ניתן לתת מעצמנו, אז אין לנו זכות קיום במדינה הזאת בכלל. Uh, you're a part of a bigger thing. People really need your help. Um, it's, it's a very unique experience. It connects them to their fellow citizens, but it also connects them to who they are, their own identity as part of the Jewish nation. The children were able to do their own tikkun olam. This day we're actually talking about the connection of our people to this land. Why am I here? And in two years they're going to go to the army and to defend this country. And it's very important that they will come with a straight answer to this question. It makes me feel good, like I am belong to this people, like I am belong to this land. This morning we read out the Bible and uh, it showed me more about the Bible and our connection and our history and how good this place is and it's worth to fight about it. The tour in Har Herzl is focusing on this question, what is the connection between us and the country? השאלה שאני שואל את עצמי כשאני נפגש עם אנשים כאלה זה לא איך האדם הזה מת, זה איך האדם הזה חי. איך הוא חי כדי שברגע הזה, זה מה שיצא ממנו. אני באמת חושב שאני 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 is them, and it's us, and they have responsibility towards this country. During the Shabbat, we go to the Kotel to Davin on Friday nights. There's a big, big um, Kabbalat Shabbat. Everyone together um, during that special time of Friday evening is davening together at the Kotel. A lot of feelings and thoughts come up, and I'm proud to be a Jewish, Jewish person. קודם כל החינוך, לאבן יסוד, חוסן לאומי של חברה, נמדד על זה. אני רואה את מסע הישראלי כחלק חשוב מהעניין הזה. זה צריך להיות סוד כוחנו, וכנראה יהיה, אם נדע להשקיע נכון במפעלים מהסוג הזה, גם בעתיד.
feel they're a part of something that's bigger than them. They feel and they see in their eyes that they're a part of the Jewish nation. They now feel connected to all the Jewish people around the world. This week is actually giving them a box of tools. They feel a lot more connected to the land. They feel they really want to go to the army and they understand why. I learn to appreciate things that I have, appreciate my friends, my family. It makes them better people in this world, better Israelis, better Jews. I've lived most of my life overseas and I got back to Israel two and a half years ago and I don't think anything so far has made me feel so close to this country and to my nationality as this journey has. This has been the most life-changing experience for me so far.